Hey everybody, welcome back to a very special Horeo rant while playing The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past on the Super Nintendo. Uh, if you missed it earlier, uh, I released a video today where I did the, the wall glitch and uh, it was fun and you should check it out, I guess. It's cool, yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, I'm Horeo and this is uh, going to be me playing all the way through A Link to the Past. Non-speed run, uh, but I will try to be... Shit. Still don't have enough to put in sploosh. Uh, well then, back to the drawing board. Uh, well then. Well, this is... Uh... Hmm. May asked. I don't know. That works for me. We're gonna do the adventures of May asked. Yeah. I don't know. Uh, anyway, I don't know if this is gonna be 100% or anything else. I'm just playing, having fun, in an attempt to be efficient or some shit like that. Uh, and we're gonna have fun, and it's gonna be awesome, and, uh, the Princess Zelda has been captured by some wizard named Aghanam, and we're gonna save her. Uh, anyway, as per usual, we do have discussion topics, uh, and I have one somewhere. Uh, if you could choose any video game to get a sequel, what game would you choose and why? Let me know in the comments below, and I might be your friend. I don't know. Uh, my answer to that is gonna be, uh... Well, this game already got a sequel in the form of a, a Link Between Worlds, which uh, I read a comment today, not on one of our videos, but someone else's video, that the, the wall glitch from this game is actually the inspiration for Link Between Worlds, which I thought was funny. Funny thing to say, but anyway, uh, uh, let's see. Let's see, a game that needs a sequel. Like, in, a, in the same style of game, not just like, like, I wouldn't just say like a spiritual sequel. Or, you know, like a, 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 you know, like Mario 64 is a sequel to Mario th uh, World. Uh, it's two different styled games, so it doesn't really click as a sequel in my head, uh, personally. Uh, so I would say Mario World needs a sequel. I don't know. <laughs> uh, Metroid? No. It, it, it's getting plenty of love on the Switch and the 3DS coming up soon, so that's. That's not not gonna be an issue anymore. Thankfully for that, and that the our Metro fanboys at least. Uh, man, this is a tough discussion topic. It's tough. There's a whole bunch of games that you know like, I wouldn't mind getting a sequel. Uh, I just can't think of them right now. Because uh, I mean, you know, like you've been looking like Final Fantasy VII. It got a sequel nobody asked for, uh, and it got a really awesome prequel. A whole bunch of mobile games we never got to play. Well, I am playing very good video games. Very good video games. Yes, sir. Uh, as you might have noticed, I didn't get the lantern at the house because you can get it literally anywhere else you want. Uh, I actually found out today you can get it in the, uh, 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 right after you get the sword, there's the chest that you usually get magic powder or maybe rupees. Uh, and you can apparently get the lantern there. Uh, did not know that. Uh, cause I usually get it next to the Prince Death Yelver. Guy. Stop being a douche. Well, I'm, I'm just playing really good Zelda. Because it's, it's, it's literally been a couple years since I've, uh, played just regular Zelda. You'd think my randomizer skills would transfer, but they don't. For some reason. <laughs> uh, I, I played pretty bad in the second randomizer race, to be honest with you, so... I don't know. Anyway, I got a boomerang. Uh, that, that sound effect does not match the throwing of the boomerang because the door was still opening and closing or closing and opening or whatever. But it's a thing. It's a thing that happened and it's a thing that's going to keep happening. And why is my timer turning off? I've never had this problem. Never! So they have problems with the timer all the time. But, uh, it's, it's worse when you're by yourself. Uh, actually, yesterday, I recorded a bunch of stuff yesterday. Fortunately, not a whole lot of videos are going to come out of it, but uh, we do have one really, really special video coming out on Sunday that we... Fuck. 
I don't know why it may ask, but that's probably gonna be some like racial term or something that's gonna get me in trouble just because I typed in random words in into the the Google's or uh, not Google's the, the game random letters into the game. Uh, still haven't answered the discussion topic, but we'll get there. I'm just having fun. I'm enjoying playing uh, Zelda. I thought, hey, we're doing the summer of TBC. This is a little different than our regular TBC content. Uh, we're getting more Pareo rants. We're going to get a new show with uh, Smug Loli Chan. And uh, I decided, hey, why not start out the summer of TBC with me playing my favorite game of all time while talking about things nobody cares about. Yay! Uh, so, sequels, sequels, sequels. Uh, I mean, can can I be like can, I, can Link Between Worlds get a sequel? I actually really liked Link Between Worlds, even even with the the one downside I didn't like running and buying items, but it it worked out okay in that game compared to what I thought it would be. I thought it would suck, and it wasn't awful, but it was still like the one minor downside because it it, it kind of suffers from the same thing Breath of the Wild does. Uh, Breath of the Wild for different reasons, but there's no gratification of getting through a dungeon and finding the dungeon item. Uh, whereas even, you know, like this game, you, you, you get all that gratification. Whereas Breath of the Wild is, there's so much, you know, throwaway crap in the game. There's nothing substantial about finding a sword, you know, except for that one sword. Uh, that you, you get to the point where it's like, eh. Ooh. What am I doing? I think I, I always struggle in the first room down here for some reason. Uh, I don't know why this game became a bashing on certain games. Okay, I'm gonna die in the first video. Wouldn't that be exciting? Considering it's been, it's been so long just getting this video to go up. Alright, not go up. What am I talking about? Uh, I usually don't record, like, it's like 10 o'clock in the morning. I usually don't record. Uh, at such times, but, uh, but, uh, uh no, I, I was trying to words again, uh, but unfortunately I was recording, uh, something with Party Cat yesterday, and I recorded Sunday's video, which, uh, is gonna be awesome, uh, hopefully, hopefully you guys like it, I put a lot of work into it, uh, for what it is, I put way too much work in it, uh, then I, unfortunately, I, I planned to actually record this this video last night, but I had a headache and I was losing my voice. And if you listen to my my video before this this video, the one I recorded right before this about an hour ago, uh, the Wagglitch video, uh, I, I my voice is still all kind of screwed up. I've had to drink a ton of water just to get it to function without feeling like everything in my body is gonna fall out of my mouth. But Y'all don't want to hear about that. You don't want to hear about sequels, video game sequels. Uh, what about, uh, let's see, turn tank off the wall, shit, have a, um, I'm pulling it autonomous, I'm looking around. Let's see, The Force Unleashed already got a sequel. That was a fun game. Um, why did I name him Mayast? That is so stupid. Uh, well, lots of arms today. Hyrule Warriors. I, I would love a, another one of those, and not just crazy DLC that costs way too much money. Even though I bought most of it, <laughs> it's a thing that happens. I don't know how long has this video been going on. Nine minutes. It took me nine minutes to get through that. Damn, this is definitely not a speed run. For those of you expecting one, I'm sorry. I'm not as good as a link to the past as I says I am. Of course, there's a time in my life where I'd play I'd literally play this once a month, and and it's come to the fact that since we started uh, the randomizer races, uh, this is actually the first time I've played a link to the past outside of those videos. So I don't I don't know if I'm gonna remember like how to do dungeons without, you know, searching for everything. Which is a concern, because I used to have at least in my head, the dungeons mapped out in an efficient way. Not necessarily the most efficient way, but in an efficient way to get through them uh, quickly. Just because I played the game so much, you know, you start realizing, hey, I don't need to go to that room. That room's stupid. 
Uh, and you put two and two together and you get a whole bunch of dungeons that way. And you can get through the game like two hours faster than you once could. Unfortunately, I haven't been playing at all. Other than, once again, that Grand Watcher races, which, which uh, with the exception of one dungeon, I, uh, I didn't play any of the dungeons the way I normally do. Because uh, you have to go find the chests. But uh, in Ganon's Tower in the second race, I actually did pretty much my route. I think I went off my route by one, one, uh, one room. But that was just because I suck at life and I'm a sad, sad, pathetic person. But anyway, welcome to dungeon number one. We're doing really bad on time. And I still haven't come up with a good video game sequel question, uh, answer. Uh, Ratchet and Clank. I don't know, they got a sequel, didn't they? Yeah, there goes my voice again. <laughs> there you go, there you go. Birds. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I have a whole, whole bunch of uh, old games that I need to play that probably deserve a sequel. Uh, FTL, uh, Faster Than Light. Uh, I would love a, a sequel in that style, but make it a little more awesome. Uh, I mean, it's an awesome game as it is, but you know, after after your 200th hour of playing it, it does get a little boring. Uh, so yeah, that 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 would work FTL, definitely. Uh, of course, I, I see games like Space Rogue and stuff like that as maybe spiritual 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 sequels made by other people that weren't involved in the original process of of uh, FTL. But FTL is an awesome game. If you haven't played FTL and you like space. This is, as we've discussed in videos before, I, I'm, I'm a huge Star Trek fan. I'm like a nerd or geek, but fan. I'm a Star Trek fan. And uh, it, it was nice to play in that, not necessarily themed in the Star Trek universe, but it it stole enough from Star Trek to feel like a Star Trek game and the best Star Trek game I've ever played. Um, other than maybe Star Trek Online. I do enjoy Star Trek Online. Uh, if you haven't played that, well, you... I, I, I'd like to say that if you even if you're not a Star Trek fan, you'll enjoy it, but I'm not sure about that. <laughs> it's, it's it's hard to say either way. Um, you know what I forgot to do? Uh, well, I, I thought I thought one of the Skeletors gave me the the. Uh, I just fucked up hardcore. <laughs> Oops. Uh, one of the Skeletors gave me the key, but it was under a, uh, a pot, so that was nice of it. Um, but yeah, like I said, Star Trek, greatest game, greatest Star Trek game, FDL. Check it out. Um, or Star Trek Online, but as I was trying to say there, uh, I don't think... I, I, I used to say this, but I don't, I don't know if it's true or accurate at all. Uh, that you can enjoy Star Trek Online if you don't like Star Trek, or you've never seen Star Trek, but... I don't think that's true. I think I think it's actually fairly important. I don't think I can kill this guy now. Wait, you can kill him with the sword. What am I talking about? Or it's just one pot. One pot does it. Right. There we go. Uh, so yeah, FTL is my official answer. There's a few other honorable mentions. Uh, cave story, rather than just cave story plus. I, I you know. Having an awesome sequel. A lot of indie games that deserve a sequel. That uh, I'm surprised never got one. Or they might have got one and I just didn't see it. There might be a Cave Story 2 just sitting right there on the shelf and I don't even know about it. Wouldn't that be crazy? This is why I don't like to record videos alone. Hey. Calm your tits. Alright. Right. I should've just got a pot and killed this guy. I don't know what I'm doing. I think it's this guy. He has a key. Give me your key. Nope, that's the other guy. Okay. Why, why do you have so much health, man? <laughs> why do you have so much health? There we go. I knew one of these douchebags had a key. And I did not do that room well at all. I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry, Internet. You've heard, you've heard me lie for years about how good it'll the past I am, and now you get to actually see that the randomizer was just an excuse. When I was like, I'm not, I'm not this bad at Elite to the past. I'm really good, man. It's just the randomizer screwing me up. Nah, that was a lie. Clearly. <laughs> yeah. All right. I don't, I don't know if I should finish this dungeon or next time it on TVC plays because uh, we're racking out of time. Oh, we're going forever. That room went pretty well. I actually should show my shelf. Oh. I don't know. We got time. We got time. We got, we got time for all this. You know what I forgot to do? I forgot to get the bow. Well, next time a TVC plays, I'm not going to be an idiot. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, guys. Don't forget to stay awesome. Bye-bye.